What is up guys, welcome back to another video. It is Thursday, November 9th, 2017, and I just wanted to make this quick little vlog just to talk about the iPhone 10 now that I've had it for a week. So let me cut right to the chase, pun intended. I freaking love this phone. I'm gonna be brutally honest here and just say that this has honestly been the best iPhone upgrade I've seen since the iPhone 3GS to the iPhone 4. But for now, I just wanna say that the iPhone 10 has met my expectations and if not even exceeded it. This is a really freaking great phone. Anyway, I'll continue talking about it throughout this vlog, but right now I am actually going to head on over to McDonald's. I am going to be recording a taste test video. In case you can't already guess what I'm going to be taste testing, I am going to be picking up a McRib. So I'm going to be doing that, and it'll probably be a separate video, so I have to go record it now. Alright guys, so I just finished my little McRib taste test. You can go check out the video on this channel. Anyway guys, getting back to the iPhone 10. I guess the main thing I want to say with the iPhone 10 is that Apple delivered. There were a lot of questions that I had personally and I'm sure a lot of other people had about the iPhone 10. And now that the iPhone 10 is actually out, like I'm really happy to see all of my questions answered. For example, like, you know, face ID works and portrait mode on the front facing camera works. It's just really exciting to see this iPhone like fully deliver everything that they said they would. And one final thing that I want to mention about the iPhone 10 is that news just broke out today from an interview with Johnny I've. In the interview, he states, What I think is remarkable about the iPhone 10 is that its functionality is also determined by software. And because of the fluid nature of software, this product is going to change and evolve. In 12 months time, this object will be able to do things that it can't now. So that quote from Johnny Ive pretty much highlights one of my favorite features about the iPhone 10. A lot of people, including myself, were worried about the fact that there wasn't a home button. We just weren't sure how it was going to stack up to, you know, having the physical home button. But I am so happy that I was proved wrong on that. Swipe gestures are just amazing on the iPhone 10. I know it sounds cheesy, but it really is just like a really fluid experience. And of course, I'm going to acknowledge the fact that sometimes there are bugs with swipe gestures. But from what I found, most of the bugs with swipe gestures are usually on like an app to app basis. So anyway, I just feel like they created something really intuitive with swipe gestures. And I'm really excited to see how the iPhone 10 changes along with, you know, next iteration of iOS. So for now, that is how my first week with the iPhone 10 has been going. It's been really great. I can genuinely say that this phone is the best phone I've ever used. Anyway, I'm going to continue working here. Speaking of which, I hope the few people who actually watch Chase Chat like really enjoy Chase Chat because out of all the videos I make and all the videos I've made in the past, Chase Chat takes the longest to export by far. I'm exporting like 20 to 40 minute videos on my five-year-old iMac. So it takes a really long time. Like right now, as I'm exporting this episode of Chase Chat, it says it's gonna take about three hours to export. Luckily, that number usually goes down, but in general, it's just a really long process. And the worst part is that I can't even do anything about it. I just kind of have to sit here and wait. Anyway, guys, I'm probably not even gonna be doing anything else really interesting today. I mean, this video was more of like a discussion about my first week with the iPhone 10 disguised as a vlog. Speaking of this channel, right now, as I am talking, we are one subscriber away from 120 subscribers. That is f***ing crazy. In January of this year, we pretty much started with no subscribers, and now we're almost at 120, so I mean, that's crazy. So anyway guys, thank you for watching this video. Thanks for supporting the channel through everything, and I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye!